40 royal tickets and 120 chicken medals for free. And with that said, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stormy and we are here with another episode of New State Mobile at the achievement section. Better said, at the medal section. In today's video, I will show you how you can complete four of these medal achievements in one run of playing Siege Mode. Thank you everybody for being here again and if you want to support me just thumb up if you like those kind of content here a guide for the achievements before we start into the thematic a little bit of a disclaimer be careful we still don't know if these kind of achievements are counted as a bug that you can complete it in uh, the new siege mode so if it is a bug please don't abuse it and and hopefully you don't get a ban for it if it is not a bug hey go for it and follow this guide the first one is called Killing Spree and you need to kill 12 players in a single match. I already completed it last July. If you didn't do so, this is possible with this run. The next one, Fire in the Hole, 5 players, killing 5 players using a frag grenade in a single match. Prawler, kill 3 players with your bare hands and Vengeance. Get redeployed and kill the enemy who killed you. That is all possible in the brand new siege mode and I will show you now my fastest run which only took 67 seconds plus the lobby entering time, the lobby waiting time of 60 seconds but this is still very fast and well I did do that in the last couple of days 500 plus times because 500 not everything is working every time perfect you will understand when I show you my run why but if you do it a little bit slower actually they should work out all so we did complete these achievements and here is my run so for sure we are there on the starting area with the countdown running down to start the match the very important thing is i joined here with a second device and a second account this can also be done by a friend of you who then completes all the same achievements in that same run that is working but you need to be a little bit more fast if i should do that guide with a second real player where both do that just let me know it down below in the comment section after then starting the round it's very easy let's have a look into it we are starting running over directly to the inhibitor in the center of the map which is there to get destroyed and somehow controls the Luzum. We are staying then on the other side where the bots are running from. I'm causing a little bit of damage. Unfortunately, I killed the first one that you don't need to hit them that often. Jumping back, putting the weapon back, hitting the first, hitting the second. That's the second kill with the punch. That is one of the achievements. And there's the third one. Then just throwing in the grenade. You can better do that with the short throw distance. I did do it there with the long throw distance, but it still worked. Then the bots knock you down and you need to click give up before the grenade explodes because then the kills are already triggered after you're dead and that is very important for vengeance. The second account just runs towards the blue zone and dies there just in time. 5 to 8 seconds is the time where that guy done, uh, dies in the blue zone, should be 8 seconds around. And then you're respawning and what is happening next? You just kill yourself. 3, 2, 1 and boom, you kill yourself and that's it. Due to the fact that the kills have counted already before because the nade killed the enemies after your death, all the achievements are done in one run in 67 seconds. That is so fast that what that was the perfect run. Usually it takes a little bit longer, around 1 minute 30, which is still very, very fast. And as I said before, you can do that together with your teammate and you can do both the four achievements in one run. You just need to follow the same steps for the second player then as well. Sometimes if you kill yourself immediately the things do not count properly as the inhibitor can somehow block the damage of the grenade a little bit and then the guy who killed you does not get killed. To go save him, don't kill yourself with a grenade, get over, throw into the enemies your nade again, kill the rest of the blue ones with your primary weapon and then you can just run into the blue zone or get killed by the next white ones which are coming over, the white androids. That is working as well. That is the the most common run I did do just to be secure and not need to do it over and over again. That's it already. Hopefully it helped you. If you have any questions, please let me know down below. If you want to see more guides on the achievements, let me know that as well. Which achievement should I go for next? Write it down there in the comment section. And thank you guys for watching this video and we will see us again very, very soon.